Welcome to New Holland's how-to series of videos. In this episode, we are going to look at how to adjust the sensitivities for the displayed grain losses or grain quality funnels on CR combines fitted with and without the IntelliSense feature. The actual sieve, return and rotor losses, material other than grain, MOG, and broken grain are displayed by a colored funnel on the first run screen on the IntelliView monitor. These funnels are used as an indicator to the operator to check grain losses or grain quality. A rotor loss, sieve loss and return loss funnel is shown on combines without the IntelliSense system. When green, it means that the losses are acceptable. Yellow means that two greater a loss is occurring and red means that losses are way above what is acceptable. On combines fitted with the IntelliSense feature, material other than grain, MOG, and broken grain funnels are also displayed. The funnels will be blue. There is also an indicator which refers to the acceptable grain loss or grain quality according to the operator. IntelliSense will adapt the combine parameters when the funnel is filled above the indicator. To match your acceptable loss in the funnels with the actual loss, you need to adjust the sensitivity value. This can be done by following the sensitivity procedure. Harvest 100 meters in a representative part of your field. Subsequently, check your grain loss in the windrow to quantify your grain loss or check your grain sample to quantify your grain quality. To follow the sensitivity procedure, you need to press one of the icons next to the appropriate funnel. A pop-up becomes visible, which asks you to quantify the actual loss or grain quality by selecting acceptable, too much, way too much, or more is allowed. With your selection, the system will calculate your sensitivity value by using the data from the last 60 seconds of harvesting. The system will interpret the volume of the funnel and perform a pre-selection. If the funnel is filled more than 50%, the system will interpret this as too much and will pre-select too much. This pre-selection can always be overruled by the operator. If the grain loss or grain quality is acceptable, you need to select acceptable. If the grain loss or grain quality is too much, you need to select too much. Then select OK and the new sensitivity value will be applied to change the volume of the funnel if necessary. You can still manually change the sensitivity values by going to the sensitivity menu on the automatic crop settings ACS page on combines without the IntelliSense feature or by going to the sensitivity menu on the IntelliCruise page on combines without the IntelliSense feature or by going to the sensitivity menu on the IntelliSense page. The sensitivity values are stored even after a key on and key off per crop type. When conditions change, it is advisable to redo the sensitivity procedure.